Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Minecraft with yours truly, the Hermit Hood. Um, <laughs> I got the gooky eyes again. This is funny. Alright, so off camera guys, I built a, uh, do, 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 do. I built a sterling generator along with a sag mill to automate this process a little bit better. Um, we, I think I did this with you guys. It's a cobblestone generator and it's filling a small storage crate with a uh, cobblestone. It works a little bit better than what it was before. Um, what any other things I'd like to be able to build today in today's episode is I want to do an alloy smelter and an atomic reconstructor. So first things first is I want to be able to give this its own power generation off of the Ender IO. So I want to be able to build this with you guys today. All right. First things first is let's build this together. Now this requires a little bit of redstone, a little bit of copper, and all that stuff and things. So I've been a little bit busy. We got some copper. We got some redstone. Not a whole lot, uh, mind you. I mean, you guys will see. I got some diamonds and all that stuff and things. I'm gonna need one of these for later on. You'll see why. We're gonna grab our iron up out of here, and I think we got some iron bars. We should, yes. Okay, and we do got some iron ingots in here, or not iron ingots, uh, gold nuggets. All right, let's go ahead and let's start with this thing. We need to build this basic capacitor right here. Okay, so from that, we need to build this machine capacitor. I mean, the machine chassis, yes. And from there, we're gonna need three furnaces, and some iron and a cauldron okay so let's go ahead let's get our cauldron going uh, a little bit of a lag spike going on there the three furnaces and a cauldron and four iron all right well seeing as that i don't want to use these things behind me no more let's go ahead and let's reclaim everything that is inside of them um let's go ahead let's grab this furnace right here Let's see what we got inside of here. We we just got a little bit of iron going inside of it right now. Let's let that kind of finish up. And let's take a look at this. What do we need for this? All right. That just requires a little bit of iron in this and that. Some sticks. Okay. Um, wait, I think we can go ahead and do that real quick. Let's do that real fast. All right. So we're going to kind of do a little bit at the same time here. Here we go. There we go. We got our iron casing for that piece. And is this thing done? No? Alright, let's just let it finish up. Let's do the atomic reconstructor. Four iron and four iron ink. Not four iron. Four redstone and four of that. Let's grab all of this out of here. Okay. Um, here we go. Ooh, a little bit of a lag going on there. But that's okay. There's our atomic reconstructor. Okay, I am going to need a redstone torch, which means I may have to swap these things out back for iron. All right, we got this. Let's grab this. Let's go ahead. Let's grab this. We got our three furnaces. Let's go ahead. Let's grab our alloy smelter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So everything is outputting into this thing right here. I'm going to go ahead and shove this inside of that. It's got a lot of power right now at the moment. And alloy smelter. This thing is currently pulling from up here. So I think what I want to do is... Because this is just doing this. This is pushing the output into that. I'm not sure. Can I do the uh, cables for this? Let's just go ahead. Let's pull this out. And let's see what we need for the cables. Energy conduit. No, I don't want that stuff. All right, energy conduit. Conductive iron, what is that? Redstone and iron. Ooh, we're not ready for that yet. I only got one piece. And that's not really enough because it only gives us that, okay. All right, so we're just going to have to slap this little doodadder right here. It'll gain power a little bit by a little bit. And that just means that I can start taking like these things right over here and putting them inside of it. I turn the volume down on it temporarily so we don't have to listen to it. Um, nighttime already. It took forever to get rain, by the way. 
Um, as you guys can see, we're on day 29. It took forever for us to get rainwater, and I did finally get it. All right, so we got the atomic reconstructor. Um, how to get redstone? Well, for that, we have to pull all of these out of here. Um, let's just go ahead. Let's pull all of these out. Uh, I got to yank them out of my hands. All right, so let's just go ahead. Yoink. 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 And we're going to go ahead and do this. Pull those up out of the way. Let's go ahead and get this. Pull it out. A little bit of lag spike. All right, that's fine. Pull those up out of the way. Let's hit F7. Make sure there's no that, not, not like we're okay. We're okay. All right, cool. Let's pull those out of the way. Now the atomic reconstructor. This thing I want it to have its own power source. So we're gonna shove that thing right there. You can see how it doesn't have any RF whatsoever. All right. Let's go ahead and let's look at um, furnace. No, just <coughs> pardon me. Jenner, okay, ER, all right, a coal generator. This thing requires some iron, some sticks. We got to make an iron casing. Okay, can we do another iron casing? Let's see here. It looks quite easy. Okay, we need another one of those black quartz. All right, I got one right here. All right, let's go. All right, we got that. We're gonna need some cobblestone from the looks of things. I'm just go ahead and grab this right here. All right, um, coal generator. Can we make this? Yes, we got a coal generator. Woohoo! That's not energy efficient, 100%. But at the same time, I'm gonna go ahead and jam this charcoal in there because I'm getting plenty of coal from sifting. Um, I need a redstone torch. No, not right there. Click it. There you go. All right. So since we got this stuff going, I'm going to grab myself a stack of this. And I'm going to go ahead and jam that inside of there right now and let that thing cook up. And I want to look up something, okay? Because... We can save all the stuff and things in the world, all right? I want to look up the lens of the miner. Lens of the miner. Lens of color, lens of detonation, lens of disenchanting, lens of the miner right here. Okay, this thing requires everything including quartz. Ooh, we have everything except for the emerald in the quartz. How do I get this again? Sieve. Or diamond stiffen mesh. How do I do that again? How did I not make one of those? Let's make one of those together. That is one, two, three, four. Ha ha. Okay. Um, all we need is one. So what is that? One, two, three, four, five. Diamond stiff and that mesh. Let's do one, two, three, four. Then we'll go brrr, like that. There's our diamond stiff and mesh. Let's go ahead and jam one of these little doodatters down, like a so. And we need to sieve gravel for that. All right, let's see here how. Shove some more of this in there to keep that thing going so we can get some of this. Now, I need to sieve oh, yeah, yeah. It's this stuff for that. So, let me go ahead and see what I could do for getting some. Other, I gotta clean my inventory. Uh, do I have enough room for this? No. Alright, let me shove this down. Need some more room. Boom, 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 boom. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead, pause, and I'm going to pull some of this stuff and things, take care of this, and see if I can get some emeralds, and I'll be back. All right, guys. I got my first emerald. Cool. Let's go ahead. Let's finish this little bit up here. And 
There we go. Haha. -ha. All right, so we got our first emerald. I'm going to go ahead and pull these out. Let's go bink, bink, bink. And we got our first emerald. So the lens of the miner is this one. Now we require some quartz. How do we get that? Let's click on the sieve. That is soul sand. To get soul sand, there's another way of doing this. And I'm going to show you guys how to do that. Is you just take sand and throw it through the atomic reconstructor. Now seeing as that we already have some sand over here. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to pull this sand up out of here. I don't need a whole lot. But I'd like to be able to get some. And I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Now the whole purpose for this is is to get ourselves back to the vein or miner but at the same time we want to be able to get back to where we were before okay so let's go ahead let's pull our emerald up out let's grab this i'm gonna put my emerald in here you know just to keep it safe and uh put that right there there you go there you go there you go all right so we're gonna stand up on top of this we're gonna throw this sand all the way right there boink there we go we got some not a whole lot but we gotta wait for this thing to recharge up now and if we go ahead click on this we can see this thing isn't really gaining a whole lot of power and this thing over here could probably use a little bit more coal at the same time can this thing upgrade slot oh I forgot all about that yay um, this thing has some stone in it nice all right um, I need a spot to throw you um let's shove that over here let's grab the flint out of here and shove that in here bada bing bada boom and just keep a close eye on this all right we got another piece all right let's let that thing recharge and let's see if we can get some stuff together Oh, we got one right there. <laughs> right off the bat. What do you guys say to that? All right. Now, that's what I call quartz. All right. The lens of the miner now. What does this thing require? This requires gold, redstone, black quartz, blah, 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 blah. All right. So, the lens is glass. Eight pieces of glass. Okay. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Any color glass. Let's go ahead. Let's grab this out of here. Let's shove that in there and let that thing cook up. And go ahead and take ourselves a brief nap right here. Oh, food's doing good. Looks like we got our... Uh, might as well do ourselves a little bit of a harvest over here. Got some wheat. We got some potatoes. We even got a watermelon. Nice noise and if i wanted to you know what i got two buckets of, i got two buckets of water in here right now i'm gonna go ahead and pop this down and pop this and i'm gonna get these things out of my way so i'm gonna go ahead and take these because i already got some cooked potatoes i'm gonna shove these things right here and uh, let's shove the wheat in there let's see what we can do with that boom 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 boom, boom. nothing really nothing there we go get that composting that's doing pretty good all right we need that glass eight pieces of glass nice okay emerald one diamond one crush quartz one iron one lapis One gold. Do we have everything for this? Well, wait a second, because we still got to create this right here, which is one piece of black quartz. So let's grab ourselves another piece of that. All right, let's go create this, because we need to make that. Bada bang, bada boom. And let's make the lens of the miner. There we go. Now, the lens of the miner, you guys are going to like this. All right. So, if I take this and shove this on there, and I take regular stone. All right. Now, I think I showed this off in an earlier video. All right. So, this thing should be charged up. We go ahead, right click on it. 
Boom. All right. We got coal. Nice. Nice. But this thing will also give me ores in the world that are not in the uh, thing. So, we just... It must not have enough power. Alright, let it recharge up some. <laughs> but when it has enough power it'll go ahead it'll turn this into an ore it'll turn this into an ore it'll turn that into an ore and then we can go ahead and mine it up so lens of the miner if we go ahead hit use on this um the act went, can create ores out of blocks in its sight when the laser hits a block page two there we go and if we had silk touch, if we got a uh, diamond block, for example, if we got a diamond ore, if we had silk touch. So let's look up silk touch here real quick, okay? How do we retain, get silk touch? Okay, how do we get silk touch? Well, the fastest way to get that is through Tinker's Construct. And you do that with a piece of gold in this. So... Do I have enough wood to go ahead and do it at Tinker's Construct thing real quick? All right. Let's first off, let's get this gravel out of my hand. I really don't need it right now. Um, yeah, let's get that out of our hand. Um, let's put this other stuff and things away for right now. Because I would love, 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 love to be able to do this. I do got some, but I'm going to go ahead and shove that in there so I can see it later on. Um, do we have any wood in here? Yes, we do. We got 30 spruce wood. That sounds like a, something really good to work with. Okay, so we're going to need some stuff and things. First things first is I'm going to need to make a chest. This chest we're going to use for something else. Let's go ahead and do this. Make some sticks. All right, let's grab some extra wood. grab these let's go ahead and put one of these in here bada bing bada boom there's a part builder it's our stencil table put our chest in there pattern chest now usually I like to make two of those pattern chests so let's go ahead and do this and the reason I like to do one is so that I could put all my other templates inside of it. So one will be for the uh, gold templates. One will be for the regular templates. All right. So we did this one. We did this one. What else is there to do? Okay. All right. So let's think here. We did this. We did this. Let's go ahead. Let's type at Tinker's. I said at. Alright. So, from at Tinker's Construct, materials in you. Hold that thought. Do we have that book? Yes. Materials in you. Introduction, the tools, the materials. All right, yeah, uh-huh. Um, let's see here. We need the stencil table. The stencil table. Oh, that's a crafting table. So we're going to take this, put it on top of here. There's our tool station. All right, so we got three of these, and the other one is the uh, thing. All right, so let's go ahead... Let's grab all of these. Let's go pull this torch up. All right, let's pull my bed up. All right, let's go bump, bump, bump. Torchy here. Bed back down here. Well, that'll work. 
I think that should work. Okay. So from the tool station, this is what we need. This is the part builder. We shove all these inside of here. Um, no, that goes inside the stencil table. All right. So I need silk touch. Let's go ahead and grab our pickaxe handle. Let's grab this. And let's also grab this. Okay. So from this, I'm going to go ahead and grab myself a couple of uh, some cobblestone up out of here. And let's see here. We're just going to make a basic one for right now. Stencil table, part builder. I'm going to shove this in here. Let's go tool rod. Let's go stone cheap. And let's grab this. Okay. So now that we have all that, let's go over to the uh, tool station, I believe it is. Let's click on this. And we're going to go ahead. We're going to put this in here. This in here. Part builder. Pull this out. I didn't think of this. Let's put this in here and the tool rod pattern. Ecological. Okay. Let's head back over to this and click on that there we go and let's do the ecological instead there we go all right getting an upgrade haha -ha. all right so now that we have all of this uh, this thing should be able to upgrade on its own as we use it so i don't really need this pickaxes anymore i could actually throw them out but i need silk touch so to get that silk touch, we need gold and to milk the silky jewel, we need another emerald. So let me go ahead and get ourselves another emerald, guys. But let's make those four cloths that we're going to need. Uh, that would be four pieces of gold around string. Okay. So let's go ahead. Let's grab four pieces of gold. One, two, three, four. Let's grab some string. And let's go ahead and do this. There we go. Alright. We got our string for that so we can make our silk touch. Because I definitely want silk touch on this. Not fortune. And I'm going to go ahead and sieve until I get another emerald. I'll be back. Alright guys, I'm back. We got ourselves another emerald. Let's go ahead and... Whoa, I gotta check that real quick. Um, let's shove this inside of here. Got an emerald. Got some good chunk of gold and stuffing things up out of this. Shove this in here. Shove that in there. We got our silky cloth. Let's go ahead and make our thingamabobber that we need. Let's go boom, 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 boom. Take our emerald. Put that in there. Let's get our silky jewel. Let's you know what? I feel like going straight to this. Let's go to our thing. Shove this in there. Um, I think this goes here. That's the part builder. Tool station. Put this in there. Put that in there. There's our silk touch. All right. Uh, modifiers left is two. That's okay because this thing should update on its own and give us our own thing. Um, XP right now is only two, so every time it updates, it'll give us its own thing, so that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. I'm going to let this thing upgrade on its own. We are getting more diamonds, which is really cool. Uh, pardon me. Um, <laughs> listen to me burping away here, guys. I'm getting some more gravel. Um, I can swap that thing over to other stuff and things, but eh, got to keep this thing up and going. There we go. Um, this thing is fully charged up, so if I need to cook anything, I can cook it. Um, this thing, let's top that off with a little bit more coal. All right, so we need the, where did we put that stone? Right here. We need stone, and we need to turn this into diamond ore, okay? So let's go ahead and let's do this. All right, first one. All right, we got some bauxite ore. Stop it.
All right, let's let this one do its thing. Um, I'm knocking torches out of here. All right, we got tin ore. New ore miner, not bad. We got an industrial IC2 thing, guys. So we got some coal ore, we got some bauxite ore. One thing I would like to do is get some iron and see if I can apply it to my pickaxe. But I think we need to do something for this. All right, can we click on this? No, not that. This. Let's see if we can put this in there and put this in there. No, I think we actually need the iron pickaxe head. So let me go over toward the part builder. Let's see if I can do... Where did I put that pickaxe head? I think I shoved it inside the chest. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's do tool station, part builder. Shove this in there. Shove this in there. Nope, I actually have to use the Tinker's Construct thingamajiggy. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. It was worth a shot. I know. I know you have to use it. But uh, I think... Um, what is the mining level on this? Mining level on this is clumsy. I can't do anything higher than control for more. Mining level is iron. Okay. We can't do diamonds. So if we get a diamond, I'm not sure if I can get it. We'll see. All right. We got some copper. Looking for some iron ore. This is tin ore. Nope, not enough power. Okay, we'll leave it be. Um, is there anything else that we can do? Right now, it, it's limited on the power that it has. Do, 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 do. Drill silk touch. And I don't think there much is anything in the way we can do. Maybe top this thing off while we're at it. I did see more flint come through. So we got some bauxite ore. We got some coal ore. We got some tin ore. We got some copper ore. We need iron and we need... Alright, so let me show you guys this. We need the... not. We need the resource miner. All right, so this is the first thing that we need. It's a tier one. This thing requires gold block, um, end stone, nether rack, and the laser core. Now, you're probably wondering, well, how are you going to get to all this? End stone is easy. What we got to do for this is you can do this through a stone barrel, which is a bucket of lava in this. Now, how do you get a bucket of lava? Well, you can get this through fluid transposer. Yeah, uh-huh. Um, that's easy to do, but we can get to that at a later date. We can get this through fire essence. If you look at this, you get the fire seeds as prudentium and all that stuff and things. But we can get that a different way. All right. We can get lava through... I'm trying to think of a way you can do this. Um... Do, 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 do. Um, trying to think. Black quartz? Okay, no, not, that's not the way. Barrel. All right. I think we need porcelain and, yeah, we need porcelain. 
Do I have any... No, I don't have any. I'm going to have to sieve for it. In order for us to make this stuff, we're going to have to sieve for it. Alright, that's going to be easy. Give me this. Give me this. Let's let that thing recharge. Let me see if I can get some more uh, stuff and things so we can do this. Alright, so... I need to take this. I need to convert this over to dust. That's what I've been doing with this. It's just taking it and going like this. Anytime I got sand, I'm just converting it right over into this stuff. So we can just keep moving along with it. And I believe in order to get the dust, let me bone meal. All right, dust. Well, we can just go use right here. All right, click on sieve. All right, if you use a string mesh, iron mesh. All right, so we need an iron mesh. No, that's a flint. All right, I need a string mesh for this in order to get bone meal. That's okay. Oops, wrong button. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. I'll be back. All right, guys, as I'm getting this stuff, I need clay. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to take three pieces of this. You guys can see I got four pieces of this. We're going to go ahead and grab my uh, dust that I got here. We're going to go bink, bink. Um, grab this, bada bing. Whoops. Um, come on, come on. Boom. And boom, boom. All right, so I just made a brief little short infinite clay source right here which will probably get knocked back hopefully it doesn't get hit by the uh that right there um need to keep going at this i'm not sure how many we get for this let's go ahead and take this jam this through here let's see how many we get for this um only four and i need more clay than this so yeah all right let me get back to this all right, guys, I got a total of uh, eight porcelain clay. We're going to go ahead and take this thing real quick. We're going to turn this into this. Bada bing, bada boom. Like so. We're going to go ahead and jam this thing through this. Bada bing, bada boom. And let's get ourselves our thingamajiggy. Pull our redstone torch out of the way. Give me this. This is going to give us our first crucible. And we're going to take our first crucible, guys. And we're going to shove this little doodadder down. Ah, screw it. Just shove it right here. That should still give it heat. Put that on top of it. And heat is one times. Okay. Give me some of this. And boom, 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 boom. All right. And let that thing go ahead and fill up. Then we'll be able to get ourselves another bucket of lava. Awesome sauce. And while this thing does that, come on, get in there. While this thing does that, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pluck this thing up. And we're going to shove our uh, stuff, our cobblestone, back up inside of this. I'm going to take some of this stuff and things. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, that's a little bit more. You know what? Don't worry too much about it. Let's go ahead and grab this, because that's just basic, basically a tier one. We're going to go like this and turn it into a bigger tier one as a tier two. Bada bing, bada boom. That should give us a little bit more cobblestone. It'll work a little bit faster than what it currently does for right now. And eventually, I'll tie it into this to make it a little bit more automated. And it'll give us all the uh, flint, all the sand, all the gravel. So basically, what I'll have is I'll have one sag mill operating for sand, one will operate for cobblestone, one will operate for gravel. Because if I take the gravel and I slam it through this, it'll give me a chance of flint and sand. So that's how that works. And we'll send those to auto hammer through one auto hammer, and that'll create dust. And the rest of it will just be sent through auto sieves. And then we can set up a storage for it all. Let's go ahead and take ourselves a quick nap here real quick. 
I see we're about 34 minutes into this and we did get the stuff done that we needed to get done however I still want to create that resource miner or void re alright so this is it alright this is a void ore miner this one requires this iron ore a laser core which is two iron a little bit of redstone which reminds me that I should probably do something about that um, this is creating lava so yeah let's leave that do its thing and for the void ore miner you also require let's see here void ore miner let's see here that requires uh, what is that thing require give me this all right, the assembler, this thing requires obsidian. Let's go ahead and put this thing away. Let's look this up real quick. Obsidian. Okay, now to make obsidian, this thing is actually kind of cool. Wait a second, we can grow it? That'll be nice. But we can take a stone barrel, we can put lava in it, and we can grab obsidian for that okay and I didn't know we can grow it let me see this intermediate essence I think we're gonna have to get a mob farm up and going we're getting low on that that thing's gonna need fuel here soon whoops um, can we get a diamond lava can we get a bucket of that nope not yet okay all right it's liquid lava is almost at that point um do, 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 do. come on give us the lava give us the lava I shove this and no I don't need that right there put this right here you guys see we're getting some resources right here we got a lot of copper some blaze powder and all that stuff and things iron ore pieces we got more iron that we can sieve or shove through this but I'm gonna, I want I'd rather shove it through that thing right there yeah whatever all right so we got some pumpkins I need some animals I want to get some pumpkin pies going it's my favorite food in this game is pumpkin pie you guys see we're running low on this all right let's see if we can get that diamond ore What is that? Silver ore. Ooh, nice. I can't harvest it. Okay. Well, we can't harvest that, so. <laughs> Can we harvest this? No. Ooh. Oh my goodness, um, I need an iron pickaxe to get that out of the way. Wood helps. And I think this is where Tinker's Construct is going to come into handy. Let's go ahead and get one of these. And it looks like next episode, guys, we're going to have to hop into Tinker's Construct and get ourselves a better hammer head. Can we do this? All right, let's get these out of the way.
Come on, diamond ore. And we can go ahead and use the iron. It seems to go a little bit quicker. And we're low on power. Dang it. All right, guys. Well, today's episode was about getting the lens of the miner, getting an alloy smelter up and going, and some tinkers construct, a little bit of it. I'm going to increase the platform, and next episode we're going to get the rest of the uh, tinkers construct up and going. I need to do some seething and, well, get herself enough sand and gravel and clay for this episode coming up. So that's going to require a lot more clay than usual. So we do got our water source now. Um, yeah, we do got our water source. I want to straight. We, yeah, we do got our water source. Can I do something with this here? We got stone pebbles. <laughs> Granite pebble, andesite, and diorite. Ooh, cool. That's. Right, that's how I get those. Cool. I was wondering where I got those three at. Alright, I'll see you next episode, guys. Later. Bye.